And finally, the European Central Bank has raised its emergency liquidity assistance to banks in Greece. Paul, some say the fate of the eurozone economy hinges on whether Greece's debt-strapped government floats or sinks. So is this answer to Greece's debt crisis? Well, it's more like a stopgap measure. According to industry sources, the ceiling was raised by 5 billion euros or about 5.7 billion U.S. dollars to 65 billion euros. Now, that will barely cover Greece's next debt payment, which is due at the end of this month. This says Greek Prime Minister Alexis Tsipras took his new government's debt relief and reform plan to an EU summit in Brussels. He said he was confident that a deal could be brokered in time before the current bailout agreement expires with its European creditors. Eurogroup chairman Jerome Disselblom, however, said he was more cautious than hopeful. Uh, I'm optimistic that we'll have an outcome on the technical process, because I think that's simply a matter of comparing the different uh, measures and the content of the programs. Um, I am very cautious on the political side. It's going to be very difficult. It's going to take time, uh, and don't get your hopes up. Last week, the European Central Bank announced it would no longer accept Greek bonds as collateral for future loans, putting more pressure on Athens. But with thousands of people rallying across Greece in support of the government's anti-austerity stance, it may be difficult to reach a compromise. Cherry?